Hey guys, welcome to the first Modern Man vlog. This is the first video I'm posting to this channel that I created. Um, and I thought what would be something cool to do is to feature uh, an unboxing of Gucci slides that I recently got. Um, I just started to open the box a little bit because it's impossible to do it with one hand. But these are Gucci slides, the 2018s. Um, so you're not gonna know, you're probably expecting to see red and green. These are the other ones. These are the red, white, and blues. Um, so these were a present actually from my girlfriend for Valentine's Day. Haven't really worn them, haven't really used them because it's just been too cold. You know, I live in Toronto and so the weather here is uh, slowly getting better but it's been pretty cold the last couple months. But with the spring and summer coming, I figured, hey, might be a good time to, to talk about these for folks that are interested in looking at them. Uh, these were purchased at Saks Fifth Avenue here in Toronto at the Eaton Center. Um, you obviously can get these at a number of high-end retail stores. The retail price for these new, $250 um, plus tax, and that's $250 Canadian for everyone else uh, who isn't from Canada. Um, but yeah, so I thought I'd open them up, do an unboxing, show you what you're going to get when you, uh, if you decide to pursue these sandals and uh, talk a little bit about the quality and things like that. So let's open it up. So first thing you're gonna see, and granted I've taken the uh, the packaging plastic and things out of, here, out of here just to make it simple, but standard Gucci box, high quality box. I mean, you know, I've seen people selling the box once they've got the sandals or the clothing or whatever they're, they're getting, they'll just go ahead and sell the box and you can actually get like 30, $40 just for a box that says Gucci on it. So. If you're looking to make a little extra money, that might be an option for you. Um, anyways, standard box, open that thing up. Here we go, red, white, and blue, just like I said. So, what you're gonna see, these are size 13s. Um, you know, you've got the leather paint on there, the red, white, and blue, the Gucci on the side, and on the bottom, you know, that Gucci logo with the sort of Gucci uh, pattern all over it. I wore these around the house the other day just to sort of uh, get a feel for them. That's why they're a little dusty, but um, really nice, sturdy sandal, uh, slide, if whatever you want to call it. Um, so yeah, I mean, like I said, most people would say, well, you know, red and green is like the most recognizable sandal. I thought about that, but I actually like the red, white, and blue. I think it's a little bit different. It's sort of fresh, um, you know, evolution of the brand and the slide. So that's what, that's the right sandal. Left sandal, same thing. Um, the bottom with the Gucci logos and whatnot. Gucci logo on the outside of the sandal. Pretty cool. And then inside, this is actually something that I really like. Um, you've got individual Gucci silk bags for each of your slides. So let's say you are traveling, you're going on a trip. I'm actually going to Miami in a month and a half, so um, I'll definitely be using these. But you can put your sandal in each of these bags. Um, it has a little drawstring at the top uh, to tighten it up and uh, transport your sandals. Because I'll tell you, I sort of realized why they did this. When you have leather paint on any kind of shoe or, or item, you don't want leather paint touching other leather paint for an extended period of time. Because what happens, they start sticking together. And when I first got these, I actually had these side by side and they touched and there's a little bit of a scuff actually uh, from when they touched for like overnight and when I went to take them and, and take them out of the box there was a bit of a you know it stuck together a little bit which is a little crazy so I understand now why they do this I would recommend whether you're using these Gucci uh, silk bags or, or putting them in, in another kind of bag either package them back to back like this or uh, use the bags because you don't want to damage $250 slides for no reason Having said that, there are a number of channels and a number of videos I've seen of how to touch up the paint should you do this. And one, do not use a Sharpie. Red, blue, white, whatever. Do not use a Sharpie. Don't use normal paint. It doesn't work. You need special leather paint. And you can get that off, um, off Amazon. And uh, actually, I got mine off eBay. Uh, I'll put the link in the description for the paint place that I got it from. But I got the red paint just to touch up the little scuff that I had. Um, you know, test it out on a very small area, let it dry and see how it looks. But regardless of how you want to touch up the scuffs or scratches you get just from wear and tear, use leather paint. It's the only way to fix it properly. Um, yeah, so I mean in the box you're getting two of these bags. 
and then you're getting this little sort of little description I guess about how they source uh, ethically or things like that for some of their materials um, I think it's pretty cool I think for you know if you're gonna spend $250 on sandals and you've got all these other brands out there like Givenchy and um, uh, Prada and Fendi and all that kind of stuff uh, the Gucci slides seem to be a staple seem to be the most recognizable I find um, and it's something that I wanted and my girlfriend just happened to get it for me so very cool um, yeah totally would recommend them you know you may want to stick to the traditional red and green because it's got that sort of recognition and you know you got that swag um, with these are a little newer so people haven't quite seen them as much yet but I guarantee you over the next uh, few months when the summer starts getting going people are gonna see these more and more often $250 Canadian plus tax from Saks Fifth Avenue anyways I hope you enjoyed the video. If you're looking to uh, see more content like this, leave a message, leave a comment. Definitely like, uh, click the like button, smash the subscribe button. I'm gonna be posting a lot of content featuring uh, fashion and uh, food and technology and things like that. All the things that you would care about um, if you are down with pop culture and, uh, and yeah, in the uh, sort of modern world. So, hope you enjoyed the video. See you guys soon. Have a great rest of your weekend.